We will start designing the news timeline. I will divide this topic into two videos. So this is the part one and the next tutorial will be the part two because it is very long. Okay, so I will go to the activity main and I will remove this prototype, this uh, just for uh, testing uh, layouts. Removing the two include layouts. And now let's build the real recycler view that contains the real news fetched from our API and Redfit using Redfit. Okay, we will load real news from our website. Okay, and I like to put some annotations and some uh, comments uh, to uh, allow you in order to revise the, the source code. Uh, you see why we are doing this, why we are making a recycler view, why we are using um, uh, these uh, things. So <clears throat> the source code is available to download on the resources folder on Udemy course. Now, the we go to the initiate views and we need to initiate uh, the recycler view that we have already um, created on the main layout. And the recycler view equal final view by recycler underscore news. I will create a linear layout manager and I will create here a new linear layout manager and passing the context as this. The, this. Recycler view that dot set layout manager, linear layout manager. And recycler view dot set has fixed size equal to true. In this way, we are designing the layout and the recycler view uh, properties. Has nested, nested scrolling uh, enabled equal to false. We don't need any nested scrolling to be enabled. <clears throat> okay. Now I need an adapter. So I will create adapter called the news adapter public class news adapter and it will extend the recycler view dot view holder so guys you remember the recycler view uh, project uh, projects um, we start by making the the uh, the extend the extension the extending uh, part from recycler view dot adapter and we need to create a custom class that for our uh, for our custom layout. So I need to put a, a create a view holder class. Okay. So <clears throat> if you want to learn more about view holders, please go back to the and uh, learn more about Recycler View. Go back to the Recycler View section and a playlist and uh, learn about. Okay, uh, sorry for my voice and the coughing because I am uh, still uh, with Corona uh, infected. Okay, int image underscore left equal to one, int image underscore right or top equal to two. So why I am making these two integers? If you see in the multiple view type uh, video in recycler view, we use the same manner. Why? Because we are making two types. I want to display two types, two layouts on the same recycler view. So I need a, an algorithm, a, a, a systematic, um, systematic thing that recycler view depends on so i have created two integer one for the left and the, the second is for the top i need to make an equation or using a specific formula i using a, uh, an algorithm that allow the and the android and our application to determine which layout to be used with the news okay so we will load 
two different layouts, multiple view data types or multiple layouts in recycler view. This is very important thing, guys. You are making a very complex application and we are making also a complex UI because we are using two different uh, layouts in the same recycler view. Okay, guys? So, I am telling in my algorithm, in my function, in my uh, uh, way that if the position plus one is uh, having a remainder over eight equal to zero or the position equal equal to zero, load the first, uh, load the uh, top layout. So what this means? This means that every eight news items go and display one big news layout and they start at the position equal equal to zero if the position is, uh, of the news is the zero this means that the first news should have the big layout the layout with a big image okay you remember we have designed two layouts for our news one that have a big display of the uh, layout, uh, the image and the, the text underneath and one having a, an image like about 50 times 50 in height and the width and displaying the text near it. So <clears throat> the first one is having the image top and the second will be image left. This is the way that we use the multiple view type in Android Studio and recycler views. Now we go to on create view holder, this method that we have created before. And if view type equal equal to image left, I need to go and display it in the view, um, view type or view making a view, view, view equal. To, <clears throat> I want to inflate the layout having the image underscore left. Okay, guys. I like to hear from you any comments, anything, any questions, or maybe you are thinking to, th to thank me, to say thanks for these tutorials. You can comment it below. So, guys, you are helping me. I love people who interact with me, people who share their thoughts about our uh, channel, about our course, about our videos. Uh, so guys, I hope you uh, uh, comment below, message me, uh, ask me. I am here to help you. My, my, me and my team is to help you. Even if we are infected with Corona or any other thing, any virus, we are helping you to learn because we didn't stop learning every day you should learn i am making these videos to help you to learn every day something new so help us to keep making to stay alive to help us making new tutorials rate us five stars on udemy subscribe to our youtube channel download our master coding application from play store and rate us five stars you are helping us thank you guys now uh, thank uh, thanks for making this motivational speech i'm thinking about making a motivational speech channel uh, so i have created a view holder and inside this view holder i need to pass it to pass the view that i have created to this view holder and i will create an else statement that inflate the item underscore uh, start item that it which is big and <clears throat> return none till now i will return it null later on i will edit it okay guys so <clears throat> i will create get item count method return news 
dot size and above the item get item new account i will create a new method called on bind view holder next video okay so this method we are going to edit it into the next video now let me uh, finish the view holder and i will so is see you in the next videos so the uh, view holder holder and the image view news image and i will create the text views news the title i have want to create five text views news description news date news views need to create and the news score or news count and news source okay so these are the five new, uh, text views <clears throat> and inside the view holder i will create holder dot equal to item view and news image will holder dot find view by id oops what i'm making news underscore image in the same way i need to create to instantiate the other four text views so we are uh, making a complex application that uh, that have many topics so i advise you so guys to uh, to make a, get a, a, a pen and a paper and write down what the steps or write down the general steps like making the api on the on uh, on the server side ma making the application on android studio uh, having the hierarchy hierarchy a schema for what we have done for which uh, the, what is the class this uh, is used for why we are doing this why we need adapters why we need uh, things now why we are using a uh, retrofit why we write down something write down uh, the, the schema write down uh, very uh, no very good notes to remember to later on that will help you in your future uh, projects uh, I uh, I uh, personally make like this, okay. So holder dot find view by IE R dot news source, okay. Till now we have finished this. And in the next video, as I told you, that we are going to create the unbind view holder. So, thank you guys. Till now, we have created a very big part uh, of our application. So, keep us making new tutorials by rating us five stars in Udemy. And please store by downloading our application, Master Coding. And subscribe to our YouTube channel to keep making free uh, videos, Master Coding. Thank you, guys. See you next next video.